What's up, motherfuckers? What the fuck is up? Welcome back to Cooking with Bird Martinez, the one, the only Bird Motherfucking Martinez. First of all, I want to thank everybody for subscribing to my shit, you know, rocking with little old me, watching my videos for me, loving shit. I really feel happy and I appreciate every single one of you motherfuckers. But, anyways, today I'm gonna make some basic ass shit rice, Mexican rice, Spanish rice, yellow rice, whatever fuck you want to call it. When I started cooking, I could not make any fucking rice. Maya would always be like, oh, it's good. Because some of it was uncooked, some of it was overcooked. It was all clumped up. It was either too dark or it was too bright. I'm not saying the color matters, but you know, when you when you see some good Mexican rice, you want to see it complete, you know? You want to see it beautiful. And you want to be proud of your motherfucking rice. So, let's do this. Um, shout out to Cowgirl Beef Bop. She's the one that um, commented on my Instagram and said, can you make some rice because mine sucks. So here you go, girl. So for this, Sofia's sneezing in the background. I'm gonna use this brand, it's called Valle Verde. But if you don't have that brand, it's all good. Just make sure you have some rice that it's like long, you know, long grain, I think that's how you call it. And then if you're gonna use some Tomate consomme and some pollo consomme. If you don't have both, just use either or. Or use whatever the fuck you have, you know? Some tomato paste. I'm gonna use five tomatoes, onion, and garlic. And let's do this. Oh, you also need some motherfucking water. So let's do this, motherfuckers. Okay, so first of all, for the measuring thing, I always use one plate. And I always put it in a drainer. And I wash it and I leave it there draining for like 10 minutes. So that's what, exactly what I'm going to do. So just wash it like this all the way through. And then you're going to put it in a drainer so you could leave it like in a plate like this. So while that's draining, we're going to do the little sauce, the little remix. But make sure you have like a pot that has a lid on it because you are going to need to close this bitch up. I know you guys are wondering, Bird, are you just gonna make some fucking rice? Is that what you're gonna eat? No, I'm gonna show you guys what I'm cooking. I'm making some carne a la mexicana. Just some carne ranchera, tomato, onions. Oh, this goes so good with fucking rice. Ooh, wee! Okay, now we're gonna do a little remix, mix, mix. I'm gonna show you guys how I do it. Okay, so in the blender, put some tomatoes. I like to cut them like in half, kind of half. I don't know what I'm doing right there, but there you go. Put some onion, like this much. I put a little bit more because I love onion. A garlic clove. And now I'm going to put the consomme. So, I usually just throw it in there. But since I'm teaching you guys, two teaspoons, I guess. All good. And then, two teaspoons of this bitch over here. Like so. I should use a spoon because sometimes I put a lot. And the tomato paste. And then we're gonna fill it up with water, like halfway. Mm, less than half, a little bit less than half. So it says I, right here that I filled it up six cups. So six cups, I guess. Blend that bitch, blend that bitch, blend that oh, 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 oh. Okay, so a little remix right there is ready, nice and ready to go. And our mm. rice and nice and dry, it's nice and drained. So now for the good part. Okay, so for this part, we're gonna use some masola. We're gonna put it in the caserola, the pot or whatever. And the trick is, you get a little bit of onion, right? You put it with the oil. Once the onion is cooked, it means the oil is hot enough. You you want the oil to be hot and ready so you can put the motherfucking rice in there. You know what I mean? What the fuck that in my hair? Okay. While I'm waiting, I like to wash some dishes. You know what I'm saying? Gotta keep shit clean. Now, I hate washing dishes, but you know, part of cooking is cleaning. You, have, you gotta have a nice, you know, clean kitchen if you wanna cook food. Or else you're gonna get cucarachas. And I know this house, this kitchen's not fancy as fuck, but you have never, ever seen a motherfucking cucaracha walking around. And that makes my ass proud because I grew up with cucarachas. Me and cucarachas were like family, you know? We woke up together, we ate together, but it wasn't my mama's fault, you know? We just live in the old ass house that squeaked, you know, it's, it's gross. I'll tell you guys the story on my other channel one day. Okay, see how that's cooking already? Okay, it's time now to put the rice. Woo! 
and we're just going to move it around until it turns golden brown. Now don't let it stick. Just move it around until it turns golden motherfucking brown, motherfuckers! Okay, see that color? Brownish? That's what you want, okay? Golden brown, I guess it's called. Okay, so for this part, you're gonna need a shield, and that is the top, and you're gonna pull it. in the middle between medium and high and make sure your pot's in the middle because a lot of times you put your pot on the side on the other side make sure it's in the middle that's gonna help okay motherfuckers when you guys check your rice make sure you have a fork and just go like this okay a lot of bagels motherfuckers so it's been like 30 minutes the rice pretty much done that's how it looks I just, I'm just gonna turn it off and put the top on it so it could like finish off like 10 minutes. Okay, so this is how it looks. I'm just gonna get a little bit of rice, put it in a taco, put some salsita, cause you know you can never go wrong with some salsa. Okay, motherfuckers, here we go. I love rice. Mmm. Hell yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I know. It's not like a fancy fucking recipe. But you know, there's girls out there that don't know how to make rice. And I'm here for you, bitch. I'm here for you with the fucking thing on my hair. I'm here for you. Anyways, to all my bird gang 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 motherfuckers, I love you guys. Peace.